More than ever, consumers are interested in whether the products they buy are sustainable. The Mattress Recycling Council strives to recover about 75% of the materials from discarded mattresses. This saves tens of millions of cubic feet of landfill space annually. But that means 25% of mattress components are discarded without a second life, and we'd like to do better. That's why the Mattress Recycling Council is investing in research to improve recycling rates and find new and better uses for mattress components. Innovations in mattress design and construction can bolster these efforts. Current designs contain mattress components that are difficult to prepare for sale to companies that can use the materials to make a new product. Some materials are discarded because it takes too long to accumulate enough for sale, taking up valuable warehouse space that could be used to store more profitable commodities. And some components just don't have a market or wouldn't be profitable to sell if they did. Let's take a closer look at these challenges by learning about the recycling process. First, the quilt panel is removed. If this can be detached without too much effort, there's a market for it. Depending on the mattress type, the next will be layers of foam, springs, and a variety of fibers. Most mattresses have one or more layers of polyurethane or latex foam, which can be baled and sold for use in making carpet padding and animal beds. However, if the foam is contaminated by glue, staples, or other fasteners, it may be difficult to recycle. The steel found in mattress springs can be shredded or baled for sale to scrap markets. They may encounter plastic corner guards or cotton remnants that must be picked off the steel. When disassembling the box spring, recyclers shear the wire structure from the wooden frame. But getting the steel out of pocketed coils can be challenging. Most wood frames contain staples that need to be removed to prepare the wood for market. Once cleaned, the wood can be shipped to a power generation facility or used as mulch. Mattresses often contain other materials such as cotton fiber, coconut fibers, and non-woven fabrics. There are either no dependable markets for these materials or removing contaminants from them is cost prohibitive. MRC is committed to helping manufacturers advance mattress circularity. We fund research to find new and better markets for these materials, as well as technology to improve the recycling process. To learn more, call, email, or visit us online.